Well, Novak is uh, everybody knows uh, is a, is a player that uh, he will not miss. You know, uh, he has the the chance to make uh, the most difficult things uh, looks easy. Tommy, how much do you enjoy those contests against Novak in a situation like that? Well, very much so. I feel like we play great against each other. It's athletic, it's different. Uh, I know he gets the, the one more or two more shots back uh, better than anybody. And when he does, they are I got more depth, more power, uh, covers the court better than anyone right now. So it's a, it's a great challenge and uh, I enjoy that. Uh, I get up for that. That's still one of the big reasons I'm still playing tennis today. Uh, if you could pick one player to win one set to save your life, who would it be and why? Um, Nadal on clay, <laughs> Roland Garros. <laughs> it's, I think, obviously, you know why. I'm happy we're both here together. Uh, I enjoy playing against you. This is where it all started for us in 2004. When you're a little boy, you grew into a big man and strong man, and uh, we've had some epic matches. Uh, over the year, which uh, didn't always enjoy, but uh, you know, mostly we had some great battles over the years. And in 2005, when uh, I beat you, very lucky here in the finals. I told, I also probably told you're going to win this tournament, and I truly believe you are going to still win this tournament. You're too good not to win. This. So difficult what he did in Australia. So it's um, great to see him back playing at this unbelievable level. So it's good for him, good for tennis. It was not good for me because he beat me in the final, but, <laughs> but at the same time I was uh, happy to be part of that match. What Roger did is just fantastic. Um, you know, it's a dream come true to win at, uh, such a strong tournament like this and uh, to win against uh, probably the best player ever in this sport. Uh, it's, it's a dream for me. I hope he will not be angry, but I just uh, want to say that he cannot win everything, you know, uh, give him a break. <laughs> I mean, sometimes somebody has to win. <laughs> and best backhand is probably Djokovic, just because he's been on such a roll and he's hit so many important backhands, uh, you know, at very important stages, you know, in the last year or so, so I've got to put his number one right. He's uh, one of the best players of the history of our sport. He won in, in Wimbledon. and. Of course, he will be fighting for the, for the important things. Well, Rafa and I had a little laugh today in the locker room um, after I, I won against Tsitsipas and, you know, we kind of um, joked around about, you know, <coughs> that the old guys are still not giving up, you know, and, um, you know, I, I saw he said somewhere a few days ago that we're, that Roger, him and I are old, but, uh, I don't. I disagree with him. I think uh, we're we're showing we're showing some different uh, fresh energy, you know. But we we had a laugh about it, and um, you know, it's great to play him again in the final. Uh, he's the guy that I have encountered the most in my career. Definitely my biggest rival of all time, and uh, playing him on clay in the finals, uh, one of the biggest tournaments in the world, is always extra motivating for me so even even after all we have been through um, in our careers uh, it, 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 there is still this excitement um, when we have to face each other I mean at least from my side uh, uh, Nadal intense Rafa Nadal has uh, best fighting spirit and resilience on the tour who is your biggest rock? Biggest rival? Um, well, probably I have to say uh, Roger. That when I started on the tour, uh, he was there, uh, like the best player on on the world. And uh, since the beginning of my career, uh, we have been uh, going together uh, in the in the same direction. Thank you, guys. It's uh, obviously a very special moment. It's the uh, first time that uh, I get to. Stand here with the, with the winning trophy in Cincinnati. Played five finals before, and uh, most of those finals I lost to this great man, um, Roger. And uh, Roger, thank you for, for your kind words, and thank you for letting me win once here in Cincinnati. And, um, obviously, it was a, it was a tough match for him today. You know, he, pro he probably didn't feel his, his best, but uh, he's a great champion and you know, probably the best ever to, to play the game. So it's always a pleasure to share the call with you. Nadal. 
today playing tennis against each other again for a great cause. Are you friends or rivals? Can you be both? I think so. I really do. Um, he's a great person with great values. Um, he's got a great family. Um, we, my family, his family, we respect each other immensely. Um, he, t he told me today that he cried when I won my French Open in 09. He was so happy for me. So, I mean, it's, it's, a, it's a great rivalry. Um, I know he only knows his career with me on the court. I knew a few years without him, which was nice because there was no Rafa, which made things maybe a little bit easier. But then there was Pete Sampras and Andre Agassi. And uh, he's been wonderful for the game. He's uh, promoted this sport in, in the best possible way. He's got a huge uh, fan base. And I'm sure a lot of you guys are Rafa fans. And he deserves everything and all the praise he deserves. And he's a great person. So I will say, uh, we'll say Djokovic. No, Djokovic is, is doing great mentally the last uh, few years. He's doing fantastic. And he's showing everybody a big, strong mentality. Great atmosphere, a great opponent. Uh, here in London at the O2, uh, definitely incredibly special, uh, just a night, um, I enjoyed it from the beginning, I, I played incredible and I knew I had to, because that's what Novak does and... Uh... Uh, for Novak? Uh, I don't know, unbeatable sometimes. <laughs> well, Roger Federer has the best for him, in my opinion, uh, he's able to, to hit the winner, he's able to to have the, the perfect control, fantastic passing shots, so he can play very good on clay, on grass, on hard, in every sort of race. Hey Roger, I wish you a very, very happy birthday. Man, you are getting old, stop winning. Let something for the for the youngest, okay? Well, just have fun and I wish you all the best. And then yeah. Novak, you know, he's a, he's a great champion and this is what should, uh, this should be about, this press conference about me missing seconds or returns about but him writing history that's my opinion we can go into whatever points you want but i think that's what the headline should be about this is an amazing accomplishment and uh, and uh, i hope he's extremely proud and extremely happy about this moment djokovic tough so first of all i want to congratulate uh, novak he was playing a very very good tournament without losing the set before this final He is having a very good season, so maybe he's going to be one of the great players of the, of the world in nothing, no? So. Well, first of all, I want to congratulate Rafa you know, on, a, on a great tournament. He, he played a final, unfortunately, today. You know, he, uh, he had to lose, but you know, he, I think he, he started off the, the year very well. And I wish you best, uh, best of luck for the uh, rest of the year and of course his team. And uh, it's, it's always a pleasure playing against you. You are a big champion. For me, you're the greatest player ever and a uh, good friend. So I wish you luck. You come into this match winning 17 straight finals. You had your hands full with Rafael today, two points away from defeat. How did you turn it around? Yeah, th this was uh, extremely close uh, today and uh, consider myself lucky you know, to get through because he, he started fantastic and it was really, really hard to, to actually get the rhythm against him because he plays, he plays so great. So I've got all but praises for him. He's a, he's a great guy and a great player. So congratulations to him. First of all, I have to say congrats to Roger and all, all his team. Uh, well, amazing start of the season, I think. Uh, one of the best comebacks ever on, on, on the tour after a, a long injury, so well done. Very happy for you. Just a one-word answer about, uh, about Roger Federer. I think fantastic. Siamo reinventando Rafa, io e forse Roger, il next gen, next gen siamo noi.